And now to a news alert this morning where forensics investigators, they're trying to figure out how a woman died overnight in Greenville. And they had been on the scene for hours up until just recently. Fast Carolina's Lindsay Gibbs joins us live now with the very latest on the case. Lindsay. Hey, good morning, Ashley and Margaret Ann. That's right. Deputies were here for nearly seven hours this morning. Neighbors understandably concerned waking up to find the scene. A lot of neighbors having to explain to their children as they walked them out to the bus stop what was going on here or what they thought was going on here. As of right now, investigators say they do uh, suspect foul play based on evidence they found inside the apartment. They tell us so far no arrests have been made, but I do want to show you where the focus of this investigation was. It was over in this breezeway here at the Hickory Ridge Apartments. Now, the sheriff's office says that they received a 911 call around 1145 last night regarding an unresponsive woman in her home. When deputies arrived, they tell us they found evidence of foul play, but says they believe it's an isolated incident. We spoke with the neighbor who says it was a hard discussion to have with her kids after they noticed the crime scene while walking them out to the bus stop. She tells us as a mother, she's now worried for her own kids' safety. I was very surprised because nothing like this happens around here. I mean, little stuff happens, little break-ins in cars, stuff like that happens, you know, but never anything like this. If you're unfamiliar with the area, this happened off of Wade Hampton Boulevard on the northeast side of Greenville. Now, we are waiting to find out more information about who this woman was and how she died. Of course, we're going to keep you updated as we learn more. For now, in Greenville, Lindsay Gibbs, Fox Carolina News.